My name is Alan Tobin, councillor in the Ashburn Municipal District, and this video is about, uh, I, I suppose, an update on the roads in around Ashburn Town itself. Uh, we've heard an awful lot about the Milltown Road recently, and it's kind of disappeared, I suppose, off the, the radar a little bit. Uh, there was supposed to be a part eight going on display. Uh, that's a, a part of the planning process where the council then go for planning uh, to get the public's views on those particular aspects of the Milltown Road. And that hasn't happened yet and it was promised uh, to happen before Christmas. The reason it hasn't happened is that we've had progress on various kind of contentious areas, I suppose, where um, we're trying to widen the road in one section and in another section beside where the Milltown uh, pitches are, where we've made substantial progress, I think, uh, in, in meeting with people there and, and in actually, you know, people facilitate the council in a big big way which has never happened before in this town where we're going to provide uh, adequate parking space um, for p the, 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 the people that use the Milltown pitch so for the, the soccer and the GAA uh, teams that come down and park basically all over the place and people in the Hawthorne and people along the Milltown Road and people in White Ash Park um, and inside in, in Archerstown Domain will be well aware of people just parking willy-nilly all over the place in that particular part of the road that's going to be solved we're going to have 40 uh, parking spaces in that particular section so all those small little things which are substantial things when they're all added together are going to uh, be on this part eight and it's going to be very very exciting so we're hoping to have that on display by March now I can't give it a definite date but I will give an update on it as soon as it um, is about to go on display but that's something positive on the Milltown Road the other area where there is progress as well is on um, the Johns Wood and the Castle Street um, works there's 300 meters of um, cycle lane going in there and the Johns Wood Road is going to be upgraded as well so the, 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 the latest uh, update on that is that tenders for that are closing on the 17th of January and once those tenders are, are in they will be selected, the, the, obviously the, the, the best value uh, one will be selected and uh, works will start on that possibly six to eight weeks after that so we're expecting works again the March April uh, kind of t timeline on those uh, areas there it's going to make Castle Street an awful lot safer you're going to be able to turn down into the village without holding up the whole road going down Castle Street at busy times and the big big thing because we saw accidents there just before Christmas up at uh, Johnswood um, and, and Brinley that particular area is going to have a proper signal junction and it's going to be made safer for everyone.